Welcome to the solution of our first coding exercise where we are going to import and initially inspect the cast data set. And before we can work with pandas, we have to import pandas. And by convention, we import pandas SPD. And then we want to import the cast data set from the CSV file cast.csv. And we can do this with the direct pandas method pandas.readcsv. And we have to pass the file name within the quotation marks. And by doing so, we are creating a pandas data frame and we are saving the pandas data frame in the variable cars. So let's do this here. And now with the head method, we can inspect the first rows. And here we define that we want to have a look at the first 10 rows. So let's have a look here. So here we have the column labels and here we have actually the first 10 cars in our cars data set. And the question is here, what is uh, the name of uh, the very first car? And uh, the name of the very first car is a Chevrolet Chevelle Malibu. And we can also inspect the very last rows of our data frame with uh, the tail method. And uh, by default with uh, the head and uh, the tail method, we have a look at uh, the first and last uh, five rows. So let's have a look here at the last five rows and uh, the last five cars. And we can see here that in total we have uh, 398 cars. So here on the left hand side we have a range index uh, starting from zero. And uh, therefore in total we have here 398 cars. And we can also get some uh, meter information on our data frame with uh, the info method. And here we can see that in total we have uh, 398 rows and nine columns. And we can see here in the column horsepower that actually here we have uh, six uh, missing values. So we have only 392 uh, non-missing values. And also we can get some summary statistics on our numerical columns with uh, the describe method. And uh, we have here the question was what is uh, the maximum value in the column horsepower. So here's uh, the column horsepower. And the maximum value apparently is here 230. All right, so now let's again have a look here at our columns. So in total we have here nine columns. And the very first column is uh, the MPG column. And actually MPG stands for miles per gallon and this is actually a measure of fuel efficiency. So the higher the MPG, the higher the fuel efficiency of the car. Then we have uh, cylinders, so these are the number of cylinders in the car. Then we have displacement, this is another technical feature of uh, the engine. Then we have horsepower, which is uh, a unit of measurement for engine power. So the higher the horsepower, the higher the engine power. And then we have uh, the weight in pound. Then we have the acceleration, which is actually the time to accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in seconds. Then we have uh, the model year and uh, the origin of uh, the car or the manufacturer. And in total we have here um, cars from United States, uh, Europe and uh, Japan. So we will see this later. And last but not least we have uh, the car name or the model name. And in total we have here cars uh, with uh, the model year from 1970 to 1982. So this was the very first inspection of our cast data set and I hope to see you also in the second exercise. Bye.